Here we are at the headquarters of the Royal Aeronautical Society and this is Careers in Aerospace and Aviation Live. Today is a really, really fun-packed day full of lots of interesting talks but also lots of really, really interesting companies that are attending. We believe very fervently in the future of aviation and we want to encourage as many young people as possible to get into this fantastic industry. We're here to say there's great opportunities out there and we can help you discover them. So Flight Crowd is here to offer some of those preliminary steps, some of that mentoring and some of that advice to people and through those conversations that we're having with the attendees we can understand what can career journey what they would like to have, what stage of their career are they at and hence how we can support them. Reaction Engines is really keen on like breeding the next generation of rocket scientists in the UK. Uh, we've come into the Royal Aeronautical Society to recruit some of the best talent in the UK. We're really keen to get some of the new upcoming vibrant and excited young engineers that are coming out of uh, graduate programmes and sixth form and school. We think it's vitally important that the young members of our community are seem to be looking at all aspects of aviation. Not just engineering, not just ground jobs, not just pilots. The thing that I've enjoyed most about the event today was probably seeing the different companies because there have been so many companies that I haven't heard of but after learning about them and learning the opportunities about them I definitely want to apply to their jobs. The day is sort of split into two halves. You've got talks taking place by the companies that are exhibiting and then the other half of the day is the careers fair. So that's where visitors can get a real insight into the 30 plus companies that attend in terms of what, what they do, what opportunities they've got, and hints and tips as well for applying for their roles. Really exciting times for us in Bristol at the moment because it's just rapid expansion going on. We are currently starting a recruitment drive for our engineering apprenticeship program. We already have one running this year, started in September, was very successful. We're recruiting for quite a wide range of roles today, um, mainly centred around our mission systems offering uh, and our um, turnkey integrated mission systems offering. We have pre-registered well over 700 uh, visitors. So for exhibitors, I think it's really important because they get to see a full picture of sort of the, the future talent pipeline. It was a really wonderful opportunity for uh, like a graduate or any student, they can come here and build some uh, networks and get some insights about how to join different companies that they are interested in. I think people sometimes think about just aircraft, just like aircraft maintenance, aircraft like designing, but there's loads more. My favorite part of today uh, was the opportunity to talk with uh, some of the people that are working in these companies and how they give you an advice for your personal case. So in my case, as a PG student, I was able to have, uh, to have some feedback about what type of job are more suitable for me. I went straight into the workplace and I thought, you know, I really have to get into aerospace. I really have to work on aircraft. How do I do it with the A-level results that I have? So I looked at apprenticeships. I love the fact that I get to work every day with engineers that have so much knowledge and experience in the industry. It means that I'm constantly learning, I'm constantly progressing and I get paid to work in like an amazing industry. Mm -hmm.